Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. What defines a Muslim, non-Muslim country? Does it depend on how the country is ruled or does it depend on the people? And if Islam is generally shown or expressed in the country? For instance, is Kazakhstan a Muslim country? Jazakallah khaira. Question was asked to us by some brother and we were wondering how to answer. Okay, uh, the scholars of Siyasi Sharia, they uh, divided the world into two, two parts. You have Alam Islami and others. Uh, what is Alam Islami, the Muslim nation? It's one of the two things. Wherever the leader of that country, I mean, whenever a leader of a country is a Muslim, this is called Muslim country because the leadership is in their hand. Right? The leader Definition based on the leadership. Leader is Muslim. Good, bad, corrupt, whatever. Muslim, as long as he carries the name of Muslim, finish. The worst Muslim on earth, whatever he does, as long as this name is still there, Muslim, uh, this is Alam al Islami. This is Muslim territory. Uh, the second dimension is to define it by the population. Although the leadership is at the hand of the kuffar, but uh, the, 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 the one who is dominating the country are the Muslims, and this is also Alam al-Islami. Get it? This is how they take it. Uh, whether the leader is Muslim or not, what, uh, whatever they use as a judgment, and uh, their constitution, whatever, uh, we still call it Alam al-Islami. So you see the two, two, two dimensions, right? Uh, either we look at the leader, who is leading that country, Muslim, then we call it Alam al islam Or the vast majority of the people that Alam, uh, I mean, the Muslims, they will call it also Alam al Islam. Kazakhstan, whatever, Tan, you get it, you have, you just base it on this uh, criteria. Uh, who is the leader and who, is, who are the vast majority of the people in that place? Then? Is that clear? May Allah guide us to the truth and uh, also return back the strength to the Muslims. Then.